The University of Melbourne is celebrating the 40th birthdays of two of its cultural centres this year, but in very different ways. The opening of the Ian Potter Museum of Art's anniversary exhibition, Visions Past and Present, Celebrating 40 Years, saw the donation of John Brack painting The Queen. Acting Director of the Ian Potter Museum of Art, Mr Christopher Menz, said the donation complemented the Potter's existing Brack collection. This painting by John Brack is the most uh, significant donation to the University of Melbourne Art Collection in several decades. The title of the painting is The Queen. It was painted in 1988 and it depicts uh, cut-up postcards of a, a famous portrait of Queen Elizabeth I. Helen Brack offered it to the Potter. We were very pleased to be able to accept this in our 40th anniversary year of the establishment of the University Art Gallery. Uh, it's a very major painting by John Brack from his later period. The Potter has several works by John Brack in the collection, ranging in date from around the 1940s, some student work through to the 19, late 1980s, and we have uh, one other oil painting and an oil sketch, so it's a very uh, great opportunity for us to expand his oeuvre in our collection and present it with such a magnificent painting. Mr Menz said it was important to celebrate such an anniversary and the Potter's contribution to the university and wider Melbourne community. The opportunities provided by art through just sheer enjoyment, through to being an adjunct to art history, which is of course taught at Melbourne in a very distinguished way, I think these anniversaries ought to be acknowledged and so we particularly wanted to have a 40th anniversary special exhibition to display treasures from the university art collection. Celebrating the university's artistic endeavours and contributions was also the focus of the VCA's 40th birthday street party. The party included an Indigenous welcome to country and live performances from bands comprising members of the VCA's alumni. What we're celebrating today is 40 years of really exciting, focused activity around arts education, around training artists, uh, around the uh, exploration of artists' own talents. Professor Baker said the VCA not only trained talented industry professionals, but also provided opportunities for people to learn about the arts and appreciate them. We produce new artwork, new work that comes out of the studios here, uh, out of the theatres and the workshops and the film studios. And so we generate a lot of material. And so we hope that that enriches both the local and the broader community. VCA student Jacob Batista helped organise the street party and said he chose to study at the VCA because of the unique opportunities it offered. I chose to study here, um, one, because it's awesome, two, because it's close. I'm from Melbourne, so it helps not moving. And um, it just seems like an awesome place, awesome location. And when I came, just awesome stuff and an awesome place to be. Life begins at 40, so we're starting again. And as you can hear, there's a lot of energy and a lot of excitement. So, you know, we're pretty happy about the way things are going.